is like the spider's web. Delicate and beautiful. Weed strands that go as far as the spider can take them. And every action sends vibrations that affect its entire net of life. Leon, I'm right behind you. Miriam, go down the tunnel and wait for the mountain to quit. You must! Miriam, you are the one. I know it. I believe in you. Please! For the sake of the web, go! Drums. Those demons get eyes all around. Ain't this a thing as demons, Mortis? They bleed just like you and me. <laughs> Must be well below sea level down here. 100 feet, I'd say. <laughs> oh, yeah. 
Sonia. Du devil to pay. on our Baji. Your Baji is on Mr. Brandicoff's land. It's you that's trespassing. And I've got every right to carry out your eviction. Trip. He, he, I mean, he's, he's not here. He, he's out of the country. He, yep, he's, he's not here. Are you in charge? Uh, yeah. I, I mean, no. I, I mean, you know, like, sort of. Well, I mean, you know, they just let me answer the phone. Of course they do. Is there anyone else? Fran? Uh, there's somebody here looking for Dr. Scott. Yes, may I help you? I'm with the Department of Energy. I'm looking for Dr. Scott. May I see your ID? Is there a problem? We've had some recent issues. second. Someone named Tyra Gunn? Yes, she's right here in my office. Uh, seems a little young for intelligence. Give work. me the phone. Why do you have an agent here in Cincinnati? Crazy teenager Robert has custody of. Philip Harrison? Miss Gunn's gonna help keep an eye on him. It's probably nothing. You do realize that she may have her hands full. Mr. Harrison does not take the babysitters. That's classified. Give me the phone. Besides, they're not here. They're on their way to a ribbon cutting ceremony in Haiti. Dr. Scott spearheaded a grant for a cancer laser. All right, toodles. Oh, Bill, are you in the sport fishing tournament this year? Good. I'll let you clean my marlin. Bye. Sorry, he was in a meeting. Where is the hospital? St. Peregrine, Port-au-Prince.
Mesdames et Messieurs, bienvenue à l'ouverture de l'hôpital des cadavres le plus avancé du tout le monde du cancer. Thanks to the determined effort of Dr. Robert Scott of the United States, St. Peregrine Hospital has just this morning taken delivery of a first-of-its-kind cancer therapy laser capable of vaporizing cancer tumors with microscopic accuracy. Dr. Robert Scott, ladies and gentlemen, please. Oh, thanks, no thanks. I, I don't belong up here. Yeah, Dad. Come on, Dad. Thank you, thank you. You know, in the States, these would be really big scissors. <laughs> <laughs> but even though we are a small, humble hospital, we are filled with great gratitude for what you have done for the people of Haiti. I just wish I could have done more. Thank you. You're most welcome. Everyone, on three. One, one two, two, three. Dr. Renee, these are my sons, Malcolm and Jamal. Ah, so you are the ones that Robert is constantly bragging about. It's very nice to meet you both. Nice to meet you too. Me so, too. how are you enjoying Haiti? Good. I love it. Good. And, young man, mm. how is it that you have come to attend our ribbon cutting ceremony? Well, I'm... This is Philip Harrison. He's been staying with us. How's the food? I really don't like the food. I'm just here. So, uh, Jamal, are those the glasses that I saw in Jama? Me, oui, Monsieur, they synchronize my brain waves, and uh, actually, they harness the energy of my ADHD. I designed it myself. <laughs> I need to go wash my hands. Dig in. Pardon. Qu'est-ce que vous faites ici? What? Oh, uh, yeah, ici. sorry. I don't, I don't speak any French. No, dégage. Allez okay. là-bas, il faut partir. C'est interdit. No, the Allez. gala. The Monsieur, gala. Look at, I, mean, I called the police. Got the tie. I called the police. No, why Vous would you call pas the police? All my friends are there. All my Allez, friends are there. Allez, Monsieur, I called the police. I called the police. I clearly don't belong here. Allez. Are you serious? Allez. Get off of me. Allez. Are you kidding me? Il faut partir. Calm down. I called the police. Ah. Dr. René, Dr. René, we have a serious problem. What is it that cannot wait? I stopped by the therapy room to run calibration on the laser. Okay. It's, it's gone. What's gone? The laser. What? That's impossible! I think I may know who took it. Who? There was a kid loitering around the therapy room. Okay. I asked him what he was doing and he ran to the loading dock. Notify the gendarme immediately. What did he look like? Caucasian, blonde, uh, blue shirt and cheap tie. Philip wouldn't do that. Where is he? Hey, 
Something weird's going on out back. Where are you? Out by the loading dock. Some guy just ran me out of the building. They think you took the laser. They're calling the cops on you. What? Well, no, 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 no. Get in the truck. Dude. Well, there, there's two guys here. And... Hello? Hello? <sighs> he closed out. Dr. Remy, I can assure you. I don't want your assurances. I want our laser. It replaces radiation. It makes chemotherapy obsolete. Without it, we don't have a hospital. Philip, they're serious. Malcolm, I'm with the guys that stole the laser. I can barely hear you. I don't know, just ping me. Hello? Hello? Uh, Jamal, Philip lost his signal. Track his phone, I'll be right back. Hey, where are you going? To see if I can get a signal outside. I can do that. 1300 board in advance. Do you take American? Whenever I can. 30 bucks. Come on, let's go. None of that. Cash only. Come on, man. Did I say 30? I did not. I said 40. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. Did I say 40? Don't push it! Let's go, man. Let's go. Fires up, Yee. Let's cast off. Jeez. Hey, uh, do you mind waiting here a second? Are you kidding? Couldn't clip her long at all. Wait, 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 wait! wait. Anybody mind if I borrow this boat? That I really don't know how to drive? All right then. Key. Ooh, we're not moving.
Dad? Dad? Yeah. Uh, promise you won't get mad. They did what? I need a boat. Can somebody help me get a boat? I need a boat now. A boat. They don't have a boat, Dr. Scott. Can somebody help me get a boat? I have a ship. <laughs> when he first told me what he had in mind about stealing this, this laser thing, I thought, this one start looking like Cabeza. And that's why he's the captain, and you'll never be. <laughs> you can't go to your coordinates. There's a storm on the head. I saw the weather report. The weather report says storm. I see the radar. This is most terrible. How big? See the boat there. Sorry, Jamal. I realize this is not the way we had planned to celebrate your birthday. It's okay, Dad. I'll be 16 all year. The storm is wreaking havoc with my radar. If he's out here, I'm not seeing him. Well, this is why I tracked Harrison's cell phone. Probably got soaked, my Joshua. Well, thanks for the help anyway, Julia. This laser was my wife's last chance, Dr. Scott. I want it as bad as you do. Everybody, hang on! Dad, what are we gonna do if we find them? We other them beat that tar out of Harrison. I mean, these guys seem like pirates. I'm not worried about pirates. I just want to get an alpha ball. I see them straight ahead, 300 yards. Hey, kid! I 
may not have the laser, but neither do you. Hey, you! You reel that line right there! So how'd you get the freighter? It doesn't matter. What matters is yourself. And Harrison. As soon as we get back, this custody thing is over. Well, it's found me. Dad, he saw those guys take the laser. Then he should have called the authorities. There weren't any authorities, okay? Harrison, you have a way of getting into trouble, not just some of the time, but all of the time. I didn't raise my boys like that. Robert, this damn storm is blocking our return to Haiti. We're going to have to steam east until it dies down. We'll be anchoring in Martinique. What about the laser? Well, the laser's in good hands, I can assure you of that. Thanks, Thank you. Are you okay? I'm not sure. If I would lose you or Jamal, I, I just don't know if I have the strength to go on. Dad. You're not going to lose us, Dad. I promise. Mind if I... Yeah, I'm sorry about what my dad said. It's nothing. I'm sure he didn't mean it. Yeah, he did. I'm used to it. I don't really belong here. Or anywhere. Uh, I'm sorry it's a little banged up, but I didn't expect to go swimming today. Malcolm told me about your birthday. Oh man. I know how much you like chess. I um Thanks, man. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Haiti, where the local time is 10 o'clock. Please make sure your seatbelts are fastened and your trays are in the upright position. We will be landing shortly. I'm sorry, Mademoiselle Gunn. Dr. Scott is no longer here. He's not the easiest man to track down. Where did he go? He just called. He's on a freighter headed to Saint Pierre. Do you know anyone here, Dad? It's been a long time. I could look them up. We won't find them. They'll find us. Let's get something to eat. Is that Harrison kid? Aye, the blonde one. Looks awfully young for a physics genius. I uh, wouldn't know about that. You bring me something more. 
heard you might be interested in uh, some medical equipment. I was expecting it from someone else. Yeah, someone else had a wee bit of bad luck. That is unfortunate. That's sort of what bad luck means. I want double the payment. You will take what we give you. Oh, I don't care about the boy. You can have him for free. This laser. I can get more on the black market. You don't realize that we are the black market. I can do better. You could, but you won't. <laughs> What is that? Orange juice, pineapple juice, with a touch of grenadine. Shaken, not stirred. Very good, Mr. Bond. And a nice tea, please. Mon ami, a sauvage of well enemy. Absolutely. So, who are they? Who do you mean? You said they were going to find us. We have family here. We do? When our ancestors were taken from Africa, Eddie Joe's families were split up. Uh, some were sold to a plantation in Alabama, but many stayed here in Martinique. I believe he is with a family which is seated. They brought with them their religion called Buddha. Some say that after the Africans brought it here, it became dark and evil. And Buddha became Buddha. Oh, come on! Would you like to see an amazing trick? I have here a simple handkerchief. Put a stoop into my hand. Says the magic wall. I will leave that and fold the money. And poof! Where did it go? <laughs> ah, I have you in three. Excuse me. As you can see, this is no ordinary handkerchief. Wait a minute!
Jamal? Where's where's Malcolm and where's Harrison? Mm. And who are you? I'm Tyra Gunn. I'm with the Department of Energy. I have my ID. I don't have my ID. Jamal, where are we? I don't know. Or my phone. I can't sync with my glasses. Where's my gun? I have them. I am Dongo. Come. I have something to make you feel better. This is the pool house. I didn't want you throwing up on the good furniture. Where's Malcolm? We've been kidnapped. About to be kidnapped, Miss Tyra. We rescued you. What is this? Mangoes. Bananas. Octopus yawn. <laughs> Why are we here? Robot, we're family. You're not ringing any bells. You have not exactly kept in touch. Monique needs your help. Don't make me ask you again. Where's my son? He and his friend are also with family. What is going on? Come. Do you see those boats over there? They are Russian slavers. You went to Africa. Dad, you're gonna sell the boys into slavery? We are not slavers. The moment those boats arrived, the ground began to weak. Wait, what? Why did you bring us here? The way it predicts Malcolm is the one. The one what? The one who will save Marinique from total destruction. And Harrison? Mr. Harrison's future is not so clear. Of reptiles. Some are venomous. Snakes are primitive. No limbs. They call them grip with their bodies. Snakes are cold blooded. Cold blooded. Cold blooded. Cold blooded. They can't generate heat from their cells. But they need heat to survive. From the outside. That's what it's after. They need heat. They look for heat. That means they don't like the cold.
Miriam's still alive? Of course, she's the Queen Mother. Hey, hey, can we stay on topic here? Have you gone to the police? So far, the slavers have done nothing we can prove. The gendarme, they leave me alone. So how do you know these guys are slavers? Robert, we know what slavers look like. People go in, but they don't come out. Where? The old bauxite plant on the northern part of the island. How do you know this? <laughs> Goats. Excuse me? Goats. Goat farming is commonplace in Martinique. We train them to carry messages. There's a magma tunnel we've used for worship, refuge, and to bury our dead. The goats carry our messages to the tunnel. Did the goats tell you about the slavery? As a matter of fact, me's gone. Yes. What's going on? You are the one. You have been sent here to save us. That's the second time that you said he's the one. The one what? I, I can't help you. All of Udan knows of you. Malcolm, it's just a bunch of blabber. We gotta get out of here. You are free to leave, Philip Harrison. Malcolm will stay. No, he's not staying. Come on, Malcolm. 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 You will not interfere. Malcolm. What are you going to do? Stick a pin in it? There's an old building on the cliff up ahead. So, what's with the get up? It'll help us feed in. Boxhide was mined here to make aluminum, but the building's been vacant for like 10 years. Did your invisible tinfoil hat tell you that? Maybe. No, seriously, how do you know about the. He's got special glasses. And he can get on the internet. Hand him over. They won't work for you. Even if they did, I'm not sure we can trust her much more than this dongo over here. But we can be informed. Jamal? Uh, you're 26 years old, born in Chattanooga, Tennessee. The picture on your current driver's license is terrible. You have one, two, three speeding tickets in the last two years. Give me those! Wow! And Dad says young males are the dangerous ones. There's a Facebook page under Tyra Gillis. Whoa! Who's this boy to us? That's none of your business. Give me those glasses! Oh, what is this, your college graduation? What school is this? Robert, tell him to get out of there! Don't make me have to stop this car. Make him give me the glasses! Answer the question. And, uh, what's the name of this guy that's, you know... Dante Chesman. And, uh, the, the tattoo? It's on your... A Grateful Dead teddy bear located on... Okay, 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 okay. Check out the boyfriend. He's, he's legit. They've been friends for three years. He's been popped for drunk driving, like, once. 2.0 GPA? Come on, Tyra, you've been slumming. Come on. I'm sorry, that was inappropriate. Oh, Dad, Fran sent an email when we got to port. She said Mr. Maddox gave her the all clear. Well, how do we know it's her? Tor took a picture of her with his trick sunglasses. That goofy kid in the office was playing me? Like a cheap fiddle. Uh, 
I have that same teddy bear. Malcolm? Like that. Stay here. Daddy's team. Slavers bus. Full of new workers. Well, let's get to it. You brought us here to help you, right? Yes. Dr. Scott, if we're not back in 20 minutes, regardless of what the voodoo man says, call the police. If anyone asks, your name is Edie Ferrer. Who's that? Just a name we've planted in the database. Wait a minute, what? The slavers. They use a fake agency to recruit the homeless. They make promises of a better life. We have people on the inside that they are pretending to be destitute. Who do you work for? None, but the Queen Mother. Okay, hand it over. Your arm, right? Yes. Hand it over, I guarantee you I'm a better shot. Not all weapons use bullets, Miss Gone. Put these on. Everyone off the bus. Off the bus. Move. Anyone looks under their hood will be shot. Question? I saw it not. You may remove your hood now. Move forward. Now. Move. Forward, now. Move. 
As you can see, this is no ordinary handkerchief. Jamal, is your seatbelt on? No. I want you to very quietly put your seatbelt on and don't turn around. Why? What's happening? Shh. Dad? Seatbelt. Close your eyes. How are you driving like this? I had hobbies before you guys were born. One of them was street racing. It was 18 years ago. Out movie. Are you serious? Look, just get out and move it to the side of the road, please. And hurry. Took care of it. You are a very good driver. I apologize, Dr. Scott. I'm Jean Del, Dongo's brother. Dongo went into the bauxite plant. He went in with the DOE agent. We know. We had to get you away from the building. They were watching you. But I need to find my other son and his friend Harrison. Believe me, there's nothing more important.
Yo, I love. We got some new recruits coming in, all right? Uh. Okay, bring them in. Look at the camera. What is your name? Ellen DeFerro. You're not in the system. That's because your stupid ma neat downtown making eyes at me when she should be typing my girl's name in the system. Oh, I dealt with you. I know you've been cheating on me. You making eyes at her like steak dinner. You're together. Yeah, man. We got rounded up at the camp under the T10 bridge. Man said he's going to give us a job cleaning toilets. What is your name? Stevie Bunny. And don't you be forgetting that man. And don't you be making eyes at me, girlfriend. Look at the camera. Place these on your shirts and move that way next! Looks like natural gas is leaking in. This whole place could blow. If it'll roast to death in here first, the door's our only chance. We can't break it. shall be short and simple. Do as you are told, and things will go well for you. If you fail to do what you have been told to do, then things will not go well for you. Now go to the end of this hall for your assignments. Move! They're hiding in plain sight. As will we. Did we get a reading? 3.2. Continue drilling. We need another 20 meters at least. Do you see something of interest? Sorry, man. We was told someone spilled coffee on the equipment. This is some big equipment, no? Did anyone spill some coffee? I find him. Oh, no, 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 no. 
Oh, I'm not cleaning that up, man. Find me like a piece. Tiny. me. Let's clean it up. Get out of here now. supposed to be rented. We have known about this for weeks. How serious is it? We're checking. <laughs> Mr. Polo, we need a crew down to the magma chamber now. Those gases must be neutralized. this wretch. She was found in the tunnel. Is that right, Grandma? A poor call. Pardon of it. Well, you? What did she say? Parlez vous Francais? Ma papa was of course. Pardon, no, Mama. What is she babbling on about? I don't want to say what I'm fine with, and I don't want to realize it's for you. You were fucking, uh, fucking your dog? Yeah? We were, uh, wow. And the dog got loose. You, you were scared, scared. Hmm, back a while we fell off the little tunnel to grandpa. You were scared and hungry, so you went deeper into the cave to look for your lost puppy, da? Sure, I saw you were doing it. She must think I am the dumbest person she's ever met. Should we give her to Remsky? Brat? Would be entertaining. Lock her up, but be careful. She's one of those voodoo types. I will alert the mad dog of Moscow. Where are we going? We must find the Queen Mother. My mission is to get Philip Harrison, and if I can, Dr. Scott's son. And for that, we need the Queen Mother. And just how do you think we're gonna do that? We'll ask. Tango, my dear. How nice of you to join me. This is... This is Agent Tyrigon. She's with the United States government. How nice. Would you like some chips? So what happened to the witch doctor lady? We heard a bunch of guys coming down the tunnel, so she told me to hide. They must have grabbed her. Or she just went with them. The Voodoo knows something really bad is happening. And they brought me here to help. Why you? They think I'm some grand mystic when it comes to understanding the web. Shh. What? Up ahead. We gotta hide. No! Let them find us. What? They'll take us where we need to go. Hi. This is a busy night. Now what? You may go. One? What you want, did you? Uh, I don't think so. What you think doesn't matter. Cool Orlov, have this one measured and photographed. 
put him on market. Well, wait a minute, I'm not for sale! Hey. Do not hurt Mr. Harrison. I will need him. Lock this one up. Mr. Orlov. Very good. Mr. Orlov, we need you back in security. Really, is magnifique. She's been promoted. She's one of us. So that explains why we weren't picked up on the surveillance camera. We need her here. Follow Orlov. Bring Malcolm Scott to the altar. The sleevers are awake to our prisons. What about Harrison? We will see. Who are you? What do you want? We uh, found this woman roaming in the halls. We did not know where to take her. Would you have a heavy cushion? This chair is very uncomfortable. They are all spies. They are all voodoo spies. Really? I do not do any voodoo spies. She needed a toilet. I think she, how you say, uh, incontinent. I am not. Enough! Who are you? Who we are is of no consequence. But you? You are a slave. I prefer human trafficker. What is old woman like you doing here? I told you, I'm looking for the cushion. I lost my cat in the 1950s. It's here! Touches the Queen Mother! Your woman. Peter to dogs, I do not care. predicts you cannot help him now. I don't care what the web says. He's my friend. If you stay, you will die. And so will he. I don't care. I'm going back. Trust the web.
You're right on time. Follow me. We must go to the altar. lasers I have ever seen. X-ray lasers. X-ray? You're... You're... Yes. You're creating a black hole? Very good. With hydrogen? Lithium. Lithium? That is six times more atomic mass. I'm drawing power directly from the volcano. Yeah, I've seen that. How are you going to contain this? This is where I need your help, Philip Raymond Harrison. Me. He's not fulfilling anyone's destiny. He's kidnapped! If you want to see your friend returned and this island saved, Malcolm is the only one who can do it. Me? What can I do? The key is to the universe lie at your feet. No, they don't! We need to be moving, doing things, not sitting in a cave pondering the universe. Doing what things, Malcolm? I don't know. Neither do we. What is like the spider's web? What is like the spider's web? Delicate, beautiful. With strands that go as far as the spider can take them. And every action sends vibrations that affect its entire net of life. Return to their chamber. There's a drill boring into hot magma. Flames erupting. What else? Nothing else. There is always something else. Just above the magma. Continue. So much heat. Hard to breathe. But there's a lot of pressure from the heat. The air's expanding, forcing the door closed. molecules expand. Solids become liquid, and liquid becomes gas. Heat turns water into vapors. Robert Fulton. The steam engine. Steam is used to generate electricity. It's an unending supply of magma. That's a lot of electricity. In the security office, there was flat screens monitoring the equipment. Lasers. Big lasers, three of them. X-ray lasers, X-rays. They're a very short wavelength of light that allows them to penetrate things visible light can't. Penetration will become violent with that strong of a laser. They rip electrons away from the atoms of whatever the laser's aimed at. With less size, 
the atoms start compacting. Matter is collapsing. No! No, it can't be! They're making up! Oh. What? Oh. What? They're creating a singularity. Vast amounts of matter pressed to the head of a pin. Black hole. What would Brendikov be doing with such things? They're selling it. What? They're selling it. As a weapon. I've been seeing some kind of auction for a weaponized singularity. I didn't know what it meant. You've got to be kidding me. Black market science is... It's worth billions. The only way to contain it... is gravity obstruction. It's a nice idea to have these things self-contained. Each panel has its own nitrogen and power supply. I knew your father. He worked with him on his gravity theory. You did? Yeah, at MIT. But it was horrible to win the recalling us crackpots! I heard he had died. Yeah. I am so sorry. But you, Philip Raymond Harrison, you succeeded in proving gravity obstruction at a school science fair? Don't tell me, don't tell me. In the Cincinnati of Ohio. Cincinnati, it sounds like Cor Corcamanga or Winnemucca. <laughs> but I am not hearing of your work since. What had happened? What is this? Right there. A uh, frequency modulator. Block's gravity still allows X-ray laser to pass through. Huh? <laughs> it was all confiscated. Taken? By who? The government. They didn't want me to have it. They claim that it's still crackpot science. But they threatened to lock me up if I ever pursued it. I see. No one will touch you here. Matter doesn't want to be compressed. Uh, imagine a foam ball. You can squeeze it in your hand. But when you let it go, it expands back. But with a singularity, if you let it go, it'll be the mother of all explosions. First, we'll feed the liquid nitrogen. Start the transmitter. We should start seeing the vortex. Vortex? Obstruction to contain a black hole would do that. He wouldn't. I don't believe it. Regardless, we have to get everyone out of the plant and shut down Brandicom's operation. We will get the Queen Mother and others to safety and then contact the French government. They'll never believe you. We must try. What else can we do? Don't we have a fear they'll do from once the pirate? Use the short way. Jandel will go back for Marella and Mr. Harris. When Mademoiselle Khan will accompany him. I want to go with you. It's too dangerous, Malcolm. Dad, no, I'm sorry, but I have to go help Philip. You're coming with us. I'm an adult! Let me make my own decisions! Malcolm! Go.
please. You have earned this. So, Philip Raymond Harrison, are you ready for immortality? Uh... Dante, would you please open breakers of XLR 1, 2, and 3? Open lithium valve at 95 PSI. Close gravity containment panels and begin nitrogen flow at 30 PSI. Go ahead. You have earned this. Start lasers. Brandikoff is a genius, and he needs my help. He needs the G.O.D. Brandikoff is a criminal. He will not listen to your lies. Harrison, I know you don't know who I am, but you need to listen to Malcolm. You're creating a disaster. Look at that. It's turning black. Light can no longer escape. It's amazing. The G.O.D.'s made this possible. This validates everything that my dad died for! The power he's pulling from the volcano is ripping the island apart! It's gonna blow! They're shutting down! It's a breaker! They're overloading! No! They cannot stop now! They're... they're taking too much power! I don't think so. Get out! Get out! Beretta! The mountain is the 
being poor off. We're not gonna make it! Yes, we will! Why are we evacuating? Get back to your path! Second thought, uh, uh, never mind. The, the whole thing, oh, holding singularity together, our lasers. But they've already... compressed. Too much. He's right. It's like a nuclear landmine has been stepped on. If you take the pressure away now... The Big Bang. Philip, come on. This is my fault. I have to stay. Philip, you can't stop! Harrison, we gotta get out. I can't. The lasers have to stay on. Too bad for the lasers. Let's get out. Get moving! One of the GODs failed. The gravity field is sucking in air from the vault. Here, come on. There was a power surge with the lasers. It probably crashed one of the computers. If it did, we you could... You won't stop me. Get away. Let it go. The GODs are failing! It's too dangerous! It is meant to be dangerous! If stable would be just another scientific Normally, unstable, dangerous, much more profitable. Governments pay attention, money better. Mr. Ramsky, we have to leave now. The web predicts you will die here. We won't be able to change that. More for the lies. Scientists. I'm gonna need you to push! Okay, come around! Hey! 
Philip? I saw a spare G.O.D. back there. I thought I could ride it out and show him where to shoot the torpedo, but... I can't. I caused this. I... My family caused this. My fault. Brandikoff tricked you. All those people. The, the, they brought you here to save Martinique. But I screwed it up. I, I messed Philip, up. Listen to me. Got it all wrong. I'm not the one. Bless you. Seems like you are. I never would have answered the riddle if it weren't for you. What are you talking about? The quarry? I don't know if it was metaphysics or voodoo or dumb luck, but hitting the rock when I fell is how I saw the web. It's how you discover gravity obstruction. Don't you see? We can't do it without each other. We are the one! We. Well, I guess the joke's on them then. No, it's not. They believe we can save this island. And we're not letting them down. You say we can get a signal out? The web sure seems to think so. How do I fix the G.O.D. in the vault? Brandikov's designs are the same as my dad's at MIT, just smaller. They have their own nitrogen and power supply. You should just be able to pull the plug and reboot it. On it. Philip? Yeah? The web doesn't necessarily predict we'll live through this. I know. What's the target, Captain? I ain't all sure.
coming in. Half starboard. Follow that kid! And Shorty, bring me my rifle. He's trying to starboard! Stay on him! Stop singing, Mary! Don't be Mary! What are you doing, Cap? That's the kid what took our laser! Hold her steady! What do you mean, hold steady? We ain't the ocean, fool! It's payback time, Mariago. If you are done shaking our island to the core, Morella, Miss Muriel? It looks like a natural ridge protected the city from the worst of the blasts. And the French tell me that that blast collapsed the throat of the volcano. The seawater hardened the lava and sealed the damage from the drilling. The earthquakes have stopped. Morella told me about that ago, and I'm, I'm really sorry. He remains in the fabric of the web, stronger than ever. I'm pretty good at decoding. But I have no idea what this riddle is. We were all told the riddle as children, and we all wanted to know the answer. That doesn't sound like voodoo. <laughs> there is no voodoo in Martinique. Apparently not. <laughs> but the slavers didn't know that. Not all weapons use bullets. Well, this was supposed to be a thumb-sucking assignment. Nobody warned me about this guy. I think you're being a little hard on yourself. Yeah, he can be a little hard to keep up with. Hey, we made it out alive. Barely. That's fair. And we stopped a mad scientist. An erupting volcano. And a freaking black hole. Not bad for a day's work. Neither Harrison nor I 
are crazy about this custody thing. The president put me in charge of him. But honestly, I could use some help. This kid is driving me crazy. Oh, I'm driving you crazy. If you're willing to put up with this lunatic, tell you what, if there's any stub toes, let's just chalk it up to experience. I'm not giving this up. You keep my secret, I'll keep yours. Deal. What do you want? 